Hey everybody, this is Brett and today I am super excited to go over this 2014 Ford Mustang Shelby GT500. This is stock number 14453Z. I'm here at Summit Automotive, your new and used sports car headquarters. This 2014 Ford Mustang Shelby GT500 is the last year that you get the 5.8 liter supercharged V8 Trinity engine. Puts out 662 horsepower, 631 foot-pounds of torque. This is also the last year that you could get the stick shift in a GT500. This car has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off, and this car is 100% ready to go, super clean all the way around. That's exactly what I'm gonna do in this video. Go all the way around inside, show you all the options, start it up. We're gonna go over some build numbers on this one as well and just give you the most accurate representation that I can of the vehicle. Ruby red tint coat is the color. You get the black, matte black racing stripes on there. Shoot all my videos in 4K. If you like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day. And stay current on our ever-changing and vast inventory here at Summit Automotive. And stay current on um, everything that, so you don't miss out on gems like this one. So this one comes with the SVT Performance Package. 555 of these had the Performance Package in 2014 for the Ruby Red Coupes. And this one has the painted alloy wheels in the front, 19 inch, and no scuffs or scrapes on there. You get the Brembo brakes on this car. And this one has Goodyear Eagle, F1 tires in the front. These are 265 40 ZR19s. And I would say they have right around half the tread left in the front here. But once again, didn't see any scuffs or scrapes on the wheel. And you get the Cobra logo on the valve stem cover. The only thing to disclose on this car is there's a scrape on the caliper there. Um, but not the biggest thing in the world. Front fender is absolutely perfect. No dents or dings. On there, you get the HID headlamps, the LED running lights, and the factory fog lights. The front lower valence is absolutely perfect. The Cobra logo looks really good. And then all the stripes. I like showing all the stripes on these. No rips or tears or rock chips or anything uh, like that. 338 of the coupes came with the matte black stripes in ruby red. You get the all aluminum heat extraction hood. And the edges of the hood are all in nice condition. That aluminum sometimes has been known to uh, corrode, but this one is absolutely perfect. This is a clean title history, clean Carfax. It's been owned in Utah, Wisconsin, and Michigan. Passenger side front fender, absolutely perfect. Passenger side front wheel, absolutely perfect as well. No scuffs or scrapes on there. Ruby red tint coat has just a little bit of metal flake to it. It's very similar to the um, red candy metallic that I did the other day. And that video is in the upper right hand part of the screen if you want to check that out. And as you go down this side of this 2014 Ford Mustang Shelby GT500, take note of how clean that body is, how reflective and mirror-like the paint is. I take these HD videos, so if you're far away, or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the car, hear the car, and have confidence in the vehicle that you're looking at, so that when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises. You can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. If this vid video helps you make that buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video was helpful and that Brett sent you. Back wheel is absolutely perfect. And these back tires are 285 35ZR20s. And you can see that they have about the same amount of tread as the front tires. So I'm gonna turn the light on here because one of the options on this car is that it has the track package the only way to tell if, a vehicle, if one of these 13 and 14 has the track package is that cooler line that comes off the rear differential, and this one has it. So that's a really nice feature. And 
actually a lot of these cars had the track package in the ruby red 400 or 439 had the track package in 2014 in ruby red coming around to the back here rear bumper is in great shape and you get the diffuser back here the quad tipped dual rear exhaust i believe everything's stock on this car the rear bumper is in excellent condition as well no rips or tears on there the black plastic fascia is in nice shape as well the shelby gt500 logo back here looks really good and these back stripes are in excellent condition as well just a little bit of water dripping on there so very very nice car all the way around let's take a look inside the trunk so i do have some cool stuff back here so this one did come with the car cover it also came with the shaker pro audio which gives you the factory subwoofer i do have a copy of the original window sticker i do not have the original window sticker for this car you can get original window stickers for these cars from FordShowParts.com. Um, so even though this one doesn't have one, you can order them. They're like 50 bucks. Uh, so you can see all the options here. This was Ruby Red Tint Coat 395. So 331 ratio limited slip axle. Uh, there's no charge for that, but that is a rare option on this particular car. Only 59 in Ruby Red had the limited slip 331 gears. So pretty cool has the SVT track package, electronics package, uh, the Recaro seats, the Shaker Pro system, and the Shelby car cover. So here is where I'm getting all my numbers from. You can find these online, but you can see I have the Ruby Red Coupe highlighted on the right there. And then the options on this car I have highlighted across. So the Recaro seats, 364 were made with the black Recaro seats. The limited slip rear axle 59 were made. And the engine super cooling or track pack 439 were made. 536 had the navigation system and the performance package. 555 had the performance package and the black stripes 338 had those. And then the Shaker Pro Audio 405, it looks like, 408, and then 435 had the vehicle cover. There is a tire inflator kit underneath there, but you can see the back trunk area is very nice and clean, and the shocks are doing a nice job holding that trunk lid up. I was like closing these from this plastic lip on the trunk there, so you don't scratch that black fascia. You get the LED tail lamps as well, coming around to the driver's side, just as clean as that passenger side. No dents or dings on the rear quarter. And for full disclosure, this back wheel, no scuffs or scrapes on there either. Very nice wheels on this car. Down the rest of this side, the doors, door looks really good. The stripes are in really nice condition as well. And I didn't see any dents or dings. Power mirrors, blind spot mirrors inside. You get the black on black Recaro seats leather and suede no rips no tears you also get the cobra logo stitched into the backrest you get the recaro stitched into the side of the seat the only thing just a little bit of wear on the inside of the seat there but that's very common driver's seat height adjuster factory gt500 floor mats you get the bright pedals down there uh, auto headlamps it has launch control your different steering feels and then you can do the different dampeners uh, for your driving feel. Power windows, power locks, and power mirrors. I'll show you the back seats real quick. No rips or tears back there. They're in really nice shape. Smells very clean inside this car. I'll show you the VIN sticker here. No previously owned in Canada cars here. Tire and loading information. Let's hop inside and check out the miles, the radio, and everything that this car has to offer on the interior before we start it up. You can see this one has 9,172 miles on it. Instrument cl cluster is very nice and clean. Comes with the leather wrapped and Alcantara suede steering wheel, Bluetooth, and audio controls on the right, cruise controls and information center controls on the left. 
This one does have my favorite Ford radio, which is the factory navigation system. It's a touchscreen. You also have AM, FM, and Sirius satellite radio capabilities. You also have a CD player, and you also have a jukebox where you can download music from CDs, and then it's like you put them in your library there, and then you can always have your CDs with you, even though you don't have your CDs. So I really like this radio for all those features. Down here, the more tactile volume tuning, climate controls, stability control, hazard lights, trunk popper. You get the cue ball shifter, of course. Um, Six-speed manual tra manual transmission. This one does have the ambient lighting. You can change that color as well. Passenger side floor mat and seat are in excellent condition. No rips or tears once again. And smells very clean inside. The headliner is absolutely perfect. You do get home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lane systems and map lights right there. Let's start it up, take a look under the hood, check out all those HID lights as well. Go listen to that exhaust a little bit too. I love how these GT500 sound. Got a very nice rumble to them. Especially the, the factory exhaust is probably the best sounding exhaust. Also love the LED tail lamps. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video, you've been able to verify the quality, condition, options, and of course cleanliness of this car all the way around inside and out. Got the HID light headlamps, the LED running lights, factory fog lights. Under the hood, we have the 5.8 liter Trinity V8 supercharged engine, 662 horsepower, 631 foot-pounds of torque. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth. Once again, this car has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. It is 100% ready to go. The shocks are doing a nice job holding that hood up. Those are aftermarket. Um, there's your emission sticker. You do get a K&N cold air intake. And this one was hand built by Paul Walter and Larry McKyle. Mayako, Mayako. Same guy that built the engine in my GT500. And uh, this car, like I said, 100% ready to go. Really, really a nice car. There we go. Really a nice car. I would highly recommend it from a quality and condition standpoint. I would ship this one anywhere, California, Texas, back to Utah, Florida, you name it. Whoever's gonna get this car is gonna be very happy with the quality and condition on it. And to see more pictures of this car, one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, sports cars, GT500s, Camaros, Challengers, Chargers, you name it, we got it. Go to the website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. If you want to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and sports car walk-arounds on YouTube. Over 9,000 videos, over 100 GT500 videos I've done on there. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the GT500 videos I've ever done in the upper right, a link to the, this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this ultra clean 2014 Shelby GT500 with the SVT track pack, SVT performance package, Shaker Pro, Electronics, Recaros, and Ruby Red Tin Coat. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.